you know, now I'm 32. I'm 31, so we're on the same page. Yeah. Right. And so now life, we're starting to get to that age where, like, suddenly you're starting to learn and you're starting to see how, like, what you just said, being the scriptwriter at the, you know, little Frederick newspaper, right. you never knew that that might prepare you for WTOP. Right. How crazy is that? In the meantime, like, yeah. you know, you got this love for cinema slowly developing and then just coming around to what it is today. That's pretty awesome. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, and that's and that's why like the the, the best advice like you could give to anyone that age is just like go do internships, do all that stuff because mm. you never know how it's gonna prepare you. Even if you think you're gonna be, you know, I had no idea I'd be doing movie reviews on the radio. You know, <laughs> right. I was a print major in college that was writing stringer for sports because I was playing football and I, you know, you know, like that. You never right. know where it's gonna take you. Right. Um, but so I, I would just say dive into like your your passion, like you know. That's whole, good. That's great advice, actually. <laughs> it's. It's and more than more than just what everyone sees publicly, like the internships and everything else. I think what's nineteen thousand times more important is what you do sort of on your on your free time. Hmm. So like I just remember printing off right. best lists and literally going one by one, highlighting them off, taking notes. You remember the serial killer in seven? There's like all the <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> all the composition <laughs> notebooks of chicken scrawl, weird things. Okay, well, take away the serial killer aspect and put it in towards cinema. But that's what it looked like. It was just like, all right, this is what makes Citizen Kane great. This is, you know, right, this right, is every right. this is Lawrence of Arabia. And you just like I just went through, I really wanted to know like what makes the great movies great. What right. there's gotta be some secret here. What is it? And so I started noticing all this cool stuff that I don't think some people hadn't even put online yet. So yeah. it was pretty cool. So I started a blog <laughs> called The Film Spectrum, and there we go.